Capricorn Counseling and I just wanted to stop by really quick. It's a little later than I usually do one of these videos, but I got caught up because we actually went out to dinner tonight. Well, okay, so we brought in dinner, which is different, but um, it was really fun and so I kind of got distracted. Anyway, I was thinking today about um, some of the rules of thumb that I love to teach and one of them is really great but I don't talk about it as much and it's called grant and fantasy what you can't give in reality so what does that mean uh, when my kids were little one of my kids really really liked milk and we would be driving around in the car and we live in Texas and you do not have milk in the car ever or it's just basically ricotta cheese <laughs> in about 10 minutes. So he would go, Mom, give me milk. And I'd be like, there's no milk. And that's not ACT. That's not what I teach parents. And so I started to think about how could I grant in fantasy what, um, what I can't get grant in reality. And so what I'd do is I'd say, okay, what do you want? Do you want... Um, uh, strawberry milk? Do you want chocolate milk or do you want regular milk? And he would say, oh, I want strawberry milk. And so then I would, I would pour strawberry milk into a cup, a fake cup, hand it back to him in his little car seat and he would drink it and he'd be so excited. It was so great. Well, one of the reasons why that works is because in their brains, they have a need they want it to be met and when you say no what it tells their brain is it says "Ooh, danger danger you're not getting what you need so how do we meet that need while yet also you know being realistic because again Texas and milk do not mix in the car so think about ways that you can grant in fantasy what you can't grant in reality so I know a lot of the parents of the kids that I work with, they're having their kids play Akron or Roblox or they're meeting their friends on Zoom or, or Facebook and things like that. And that's really great. The kids are still being able to talk to each other. They're still being able to interact and even, um, you know, get to play games and stuff. And that's great. The other thing that you can do is have charades. Have a game night. Uh, make a big deal out of watching a movie together. Those kinds of events you can do at your house. You just have to be a little bit more thoughtful and not just go with the flow. So think about those kinds of things. Grant in reality what you can't, grant in fantasy what you can't grant in reality. And um, I'm just telling you that my reality right now is that I have a beautiful face of makeup, my hair looks fantastic, and my nails, these are actually um, French manicures. <laughs> so have a great day. And if you want to comment on um, what, your, uh, what your fantasy that you're granting is, uh, what your uh go ahead and put that down. It may help other people to come up with great ways of helping their kids. Um, so thank you. Yesterday, Tammy um, went ahead and put down her uh, her donuts that she's really excited about, which were game nights and movie nights. And so I appreciate that. Anyway, have a wonderful day and um, talk to somebody you love and tell them that you care about them. Bye-bye.